body baby his body baby Don't adjust your shit, okay? Just don't adjust your stuff. Yes, this is how I'm coming on. So listen, I want to share something with y'all. So today was a wash, tonight was a wash night. And I thought I would share with you all just my my nighttime kind of regimen and just some, you know, just a few things that I kind of implemented and two things that I'm in love with. First one being this band y'all see on my head. Now this is the Turby band. And the thing of this is like you can put it on now. I'm just gonna take if you you know you might have a sew in or whatever, you might already have you might have your wig sewn down, whatever the case may be. You know how you wanna put your makeup on and this, that, and the third, you know, and you don't wanna get like the makeup on it. Are you cleansing your face at night, getting ready to lay down, put your bonnet on or whatever? You know, and you want to do your whole spiel. With this, basically, and that's the gist of it. You kind of pull it down over your head around your neck, pull it back. You know, bring it up. Now, I don't, I had mine up here, but I, I will show you all. This is basically the gist. You know, and it will go back further, but I don't have it pushed back that far for me as long as I'm able to push it. You know, back if I had like, I don't know, her and twist, whatever I had in, you know, that I didn't want to get messed up. Um, you can put this on, baby, pull it back, and you good money. Like doing your face, cleansing your face, whatever the case may be. Um, today, I washed my hair, y'all, and I took about maybe about six and a half inches. Off. I, it just needed to go. I had heard it needed to go. Now, right now, I got shrinkage. Okay, I got shrinkage. But my second thing that I'm, you know, loving is in line with this, and I've used this twice, is the Turby Twist. Y'all know y'all done seen it on TV. And you put it on, like, I put it on in the shower. And this one, you get two. Um, and I've just used this one here that I just took off. And basically, what you would do is, um, this, and y'all, like, I didn't have to pat my hair and all of that. The first time I used it, I just kind of let water run on my hair because I just wanted some hydration in it. You know, and just, and I kind of squeeze it off myself. This time I was like, I'm going to put it to the test. I was in the shower, put my head over, and put this, um, you put it the way it is, and you put it over like this, like so, twist, bring it back, and there's a little, you know, band back here that you can put it on it. This probably was a better look to come on, but I wanted to show the band with y'all and the little band area that you have once you twist it and knot it up it's not gonna move it has a little area for you to take and push that through push it through baby this this is not going to move it's not going to move now i want to tell you you need to wash this you know, after every use, it will get mildewy if you don't. So watch it after every use. The same thing with this. I wouldn't say after every use, but, you know. You know what I mean? Come on now. Use your own discretion at that. But this definitely after every use. You know. And I abs I have to say that I get both of these tens across the board. It's no, you know, frills and thrills and all of that. It's, it does what it says it does. So I have to get this tens across the board. I did receive these two from Turby, you know, from the Turby Tr Twist Company. But y'all know that don't change how I feel because if hey, this had been a hot ass mess, I would have said that. You know, but I have to say that both of these items 
done exactly what it says it does. So I will have a link below so that you can check it out. With that said, um, what I've been using on my skin for those who have been asking, I've just been kind of washing it with my same wash. I go in between that Joanne's Miracle Soap, which I'm down to just a scrape. And sometimes I will use what I have left of my Mary Kay because it has an exfoliator in it that's not, it's just enough but not too much. And uh, I may, you know, do a little astring astringent, which you already know that's witch hazel. After that, this has been my, this has been what has really been helping my skin, you know, once I got it together. This has been what's been helping my skin. And I did do a video on this. Y'all, I'm not kidding. I have used it. And I use it. I use this, you know. I'm going to show you. You know, I got my little band on. My face is already washed. So I put my finger in. I'm going to get about that much. And, you know, this dab in the, you know, the hot spots. You know. And you put it on. Now I do it at night. It's, it says night green. So, you know. You want to do it at night, okay? You know, I should be going up the child. Listen. And I'm done. Now, I do believe that you can use this in conjunction with a serum like if you was using like a eye serum or whatever it will be just fine what this has just been working for my skin like that patch right there that was a dry patch remember i had them up here and i've never had dry skin but this works and it's best to use it at night you can it's a little bit heavier than your daytime cream or whatever you would use at night you sleep and it absor absorbs in your skin or whatever and it works for me it's like wash my face at night wash it in the morning use you know my daytime you know which as of late has been just a little bit of coconut you know coconut uh, oil that's it a wash it a stranger coconut oil it but I believe as far like this is just doing wonders with my skin. So that's what I've been doing. Also after my nighttime bath and I did I bought one of these boxes a long time ago, but what I'll use and I'm using Pre Madonna tonight is I'll use one of these oils. Remember that company I was telling y'all about it's like black owned, it's in Tennessee, and they have bath and body stuff and oils and all of that. Child, listen, I love their oils. And I will put, I will put, I, I'm always going to put a little oil on honey. It's nighttime in case that I might be lucky enough to get a roll over. You know, and rub it in. Now, I'm doing my own now. And I left those out so that I could just kind of talk about it and share this with y'all. Um, but, honey, I put it on everything but my. You know, like really. I've been using my, I can't use it as often, but I've been using my, um, that chicken skin stuff. Oh, y'all, that is a beast. Hurry up and get to some flowers and get you some. That is a beast. And you use it like before you, you don't want no water on you. You want to rub that on and you'll see the skin roll, baby. My skin is baby ass soft. Do you hear what I'm saying? Like for real. 47. My skin is like, I mean, for real, y'all. It's just baby ass soft, honey. I make sure that, you know, if I get out and I will put, like, I put it everywhere. Make sure I get the cheeks and all that. So, you know, they soften something there, honey. Don't, mm mm. mm. Now, this ain't no lube. <laughs> now, okay? Stop it. But, oh, I, I just kind of enjoy putting oils on. Um, also, I still use my Samba on my feet that had the Samba two step foot fetish. Do the little, little uh, surf for thing. Put this on some socks now. Cheap away. Dollar Tree uh, Petroleum Jelly um, Do your feet, scrub them down Soak them first, do them You know, scrub them down, pack them with that Vaseline, honey, use a little plumber stone And then, you know, rinse that off And then 
catch your feet dry. Pack them with that Vaseline, honey, sleep in them. I'm telling you, try it. I'm telling you, try it. Do it for like two weeks, a week. You'll see a difference on your feet or whatever. I've just been using that. And my mother said that her mother would tell them to put, do the same thing with their hands. But to exfoliate, now y'all, you, they use either, you know, a little Crisco or whatever. I know, Lord, or whatever they had. And some um, cornmeal. And make a mixture. And that would be the exfoliating. And then they will rinse that off. You know, put that, you know, Vaseline or whatever on their hands. And put some gloves on just to sleep in at night. My mother's hands are beautiful. You know, and they just may do with what they had. You know, child, you can make something. You know what I'm saying? If you got a little bitch, you can always make something out of it. You know what I mean? And that's what they would do. And, huh, it works. You know, so I wanted to share that. Also, I will, you know, since I'm on here looking like this, I will show y'all that I didn't take it all off, but I did get about, I don't know, it was about six and a half inches off of it, but I still got a little something. But my hair loves to be cut, and I just was not happy with the way it was looking. I got shrinkage now, so I'm drawn up, you know, it's drawn up. Um... King of the city, cause I wear that gold crown. So give it up for bad man, but I don't oh, bad man. I didn't impress these dogs and kill this cat's man. This little band kind of pushing it back, but you know, and I took about six inches off, and I'm okay with it. And before it's all said and done, I might get another two inches off of it. I'm not fucked up about it. You know, and I will go to doing my uh, Jamaican black castor oil as soon as. The first day of fall hits, and I will continue to do that. And anybody wants to do the challenge, you're welcome to do it with me. Um, and just kind of flat twist or whatever, two strand twist. I just split mine down the middle because I've been digging the middle part. But if I do the two strand twist, I can kind of do them smaller, and if I have a side part, I can still break those little twists up and still put it on. The key is, you know, to moisturize it. With that said, you know, just telling y'all just my routine, washing my hair. When I know it's a wash day, like I'm getting ready to get down, I have to section my hair off, detangle it some with a little bit of VO5, get that cheap stuff at the Dollar Tree, honey. Same thing you use for your co-wash, if you co-wash it, and some oil, and I detangle, break it down in sections. When I'm washing, I wash each section at a time, get down in there. Um, sometimes you can, if you really feel like your scalp is really pulling the number on you, you can use baking soda. Some people use apple cider vinegar, you know, to really get in there and get it done and do uh, clarifying and deep, you know, deep cleaning. Um, I don't know why my life is a hot off, y'all. Um, I don't know. Anyway, um, and you can also, but if you do this, you need to go behind it with my face on baking soda and vinegar to clean it. Up. You can also wash your hair with like olive oil or coconut oil. You can, I'm telling you, you can also detoxify, you know, really exfoliate your scalp or whatever with coconut oil. You know, just read, you know, wrong, you know, and you can do that. Um, for me, putting a little oil in with that shampoo helps, it just helps me. So, it may help you. The key, if you're natural, and this is something you can do natural or not natural, as simple as that. What I heard, moisture is the key, you know, hydrating and getting in there and getting it done. I'm telling you. So either way, natural, perm, Texlax, whatever. Um, also, you know, I did a um, deep, it was a garlic um, hair treatment, deep treatment, let that sit on it, rinse that off, and now what I will do, since it's, you know, at this point, I will go in and put some, uh, I was doing the lock method liquid, oil cream but I'm going to bring it on back and I'm going to do cream back to what I was doing just to kind of switch it up or whatever you know just kind of seal it or whatever but you can do that 
you know, with the oil in your shampoo or whatever, whether you have a perm or natural, either way, you know, rinse it out good. It's very good for you to put some type of treatment in your hair. See what your hair likes. It ain't always about, you know what I mean, spending the most amount of money or whatever. Sometimes it's the most simplest thing that will get your hair together. But do what works for you, you know. Don't think you got to buy the next big thing. Oh, everybody's using this, honey. Use what's best for you. You know, don't forget you need to be clipping that hair. Don't don't be crying and whining about having to cut an inch off. Honey, I don't feel no kind of way about cutting my hair. So that you can get those dead ends off. I don't want no unviable hair or whatever. Cut that off. You know. And, you know, just work on it. You know, and I think... Less manipulation is better. Another thing I think is good is for is with naturals. And even, you know, I would think naturals are not natural. A dimming brush is really nice. Now I have this Tangle Teaser and I have pretty much wore this out, honey. When I tell you I have wore it out, but I recently decided I was gonna go back to my Dimming. This one had a hobo oil in it. So if you go on Amazon and put in Tangle Teaser or whatever, this will come up and it was infused with her whole world. you know just do that honey i did the garlic and you know heat treatment or whatever you know so anywho just wanted to share that also a little chapstick on these lips i do exfoliate my lips i'm a smoker so you know i had to get it together plus i like matte lipstick so as of late i hadn't been wearing it for about a week or so because i've been trying to exfoliate and get these lips together, okay? But just wanted to share that I think it's everything what I use um, to wash my hair. Um, is well, I have all of the products that go with this, and I think this is great. This is one of the most baby friendly products. If I was, you know, had a client that came in, but not baby, but you know, had a child that was seven, eight, nine, you know, whatever. Um, I would definitely use this. This is so hydrating. Um, I have the leave-in as well. And um, I used the shampoo, but I added the shampoo is not a game. But y'all, when I can't play, y'all know I use that morning after that I showed y'all about a year and a half ago. That is a beast. And I know a lot of y'all tried to find it and couldn't find it, baby. It is a professional item. Child, if you got somebody who can get it, so you get that. Get it. But this one right here, I have to say, is a beast. Y'all know when it comes to oils, what I'm going to always put in my hair, and that's her Hope Oil. It has a mixture. I do use some other oils. Um, but that Her Hope Oil just kind of, it, it has everything I need in it. And I've talked about that on several occasions. That Her Hope Oil is the business. You know, and y'all know I was kind of dealing with, I thought my edges was, you know, I got this gray around here, honey. I was dealing with some things, but, you know, but I started massaging these edges, baby, and got down with that Her Hope Oil, and I was good money, okay? So anywho, y'all, just wanted to share that with y'all. I know this is probably not the video I was looking for. Just, you know, I've had people ask me about my skin. I wanted to talk about these. The, uh, Turby Band and the Turby Twist. And y'all, this really does work. Natural or permed towels are not good for your hair. That, I know you want to do it. I know you want to do it. I'm telling you, it's not. It's not, you know, and I really think I'm telling you, y'all. Put my head up, my hair was water was everywhere. I went, water wasn't running down my face, my neck, cause it feels like bugs on me. I can't do that. Best thing to do is the air dry if you can, you know, let it drip. But I can't it feel like bugs. I ain't gonna be able to do it. I just saying, you know. So anywho, y'all, I'm out of here. I shared this. I wanted to share this with y'all. I hope this was helpful. Didn't mean for it to be this long. Yes, I came on with, you know, as I am. Okay. <laughs> All right, y'all. Let me tell y'all. you. Oh, let me say this. Lord Jesus, y'all got me through yesterday. I read the comments. 
Oh, it's so many helpful things in there, honey. On down to sugarless cookies, honey. One baby left a recipe. Y'all go look at them comments for, you know, use cake flour and this, that, and the third. And I want to try that and put it in a bowl or whatever. Y'all, I appreciate y'all being there for me. Even though most of y'all was like, much love, I'm sorry, but I had to laugh. But keep over alive, and I imagine, you know what I mean? But I, I do. I appreciate that. And I'm going to keep trying. You know, I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing. I'm, you know, and any advice, anything to help me, honey, if you're a meal planner, prepper, nutritionist, anything, much love from KY at iCloud.com. Hit me up. I'm open, you know. So I'm out of here, y'all, but I wanted to say y'all that thank you. Y'all lifted me up. Y'all carried me on through, honey. Y'all got much love together because I was at my wit's end, baby. And I do appreciate that. Oh, right. Lord, I do look. Honey. At least with this on, I'm snatched a little bit. You know, I'm really not. I tried that. I tried. Okay. Okay.